Welcome back to Magulkul. Uh, tomorrow being Vishnu and Mahashtami, I thought it would be a it would be the best occasion for me to update how to tie uh, dhoti for the Krishna at home. Right? I know uh, it will be a quick one. And here's the video for you all. And uh, wishing you Janmashtami in advance. And tomorrow we will be updating the complete video of Kairo getting ready and Anu getting ready. What I'm using here is just a dupatta. You can see this is a dupatta. It's a little longer because it's actually not the dupatta. It's the the powder. If you know that uh, langa dauni in Kannada it's called langa dauni. So dauni to only the one that I Or uh, in Telugu, patu powder is found there. So powder is found there. I powder this one. Uh, even in Tamil Nadu, I think you will get this powder, right? And in Assamese, this is the sadar. So bekla sadar or sadar hoye to. <laughs> yeah, so I've just taken one long uh, cloth like this. You can try this with a karo, please, Nana. You can try this with the uh, dupatta also. Okay, all what I'm doing is just uh, opening the dupatta up, right? Bringing the entire dupatta one step forward. Yes, hands up, hands up, Kaira, hands up. Yes. Thank you, baby. You can put your hands down. So I am uh, not taking the middle of the dupatta. See, middle of the dupatta, if you take, you will have length equal sides on both the sides, right? I am not doing that. On the left hand side, I am taking a little lesser, and on the right hand side, I am taking more. Kind of which is the right hand? Yes. So towards the right hand side, I am taking more length, and towards the left hand side, I am taking little lesser length, right? So arrange. Um, Arrange the length of the the uh, dhoti for the children because it might be a little longer based on the height of the child. And what I'm doing here is just putting a knot. I'm just tying a knot. Focus. Knot and another knot. Yes. So one knot. This knot is over. Remember, the dhoti what you're tying depends on this knot. So if this knot is not all right, then everything goes wrong. So just take. Both the sides of the kaira, please, Nana. So take both the sides of the the cloth and just put this knot, all right, in such a way that the border should be free flowing, all right. The border should be free flowing, and the cloth here also should be free, right? Can you see this? Yeah. So once that is done, take the edge of the border, push it below the leg. And bring the entire cloth on the other side. See, I've got the entire cloth on the other side. I'm showing it to you again. Once you finish the knot, kind of, yeah. Once you finish the knot, where the knot ends, yes, from there, pull the cloth. You will get the end of the cloth. Take this cloth below his leg, below your child's leg, and the same cloth you just bring it on the other side. Bring the entire entire cloth. Yes. Now adjust this one in such a way that the it should your dhoti should not be going like this, right? So you pull this one in such a way that the border will be fitting on the ankle, right? So I pull this one tight in such a way that the border will be fitting onto the ankle. Kind of just lift your feet and yeah, put your feet down. Yes. So he is holding the cloth with the feet, right? So this is left. Now what you can do. Is you have to make small pleats, make small pleats, yes, in such a way you get the border and just tuck the entire thing. I'm not using one single pin, I'm not using even one single pin here, right? So, tuck the border. Pull it in such. Pull the entire. Say, I'm just pulling it down from the place where we have knotted it up. Pull it in such a way that everything is fine. I mean, it is neat and clean. Can you see this border? It looks so beautiful. Yeah. So you have one side leg. Same thing. You will repeat on the other side. What will you do? Where the knot ends there, the free flowing edge. You will take the cloth, put it under his leg, and take it on the other side, the right hand side, right? So pull the entire cloth again. Adjust this one to his. Can I lift your feet? Yes. Put your feet down. Perfect. Yes. Yeah. All right. And 
then what do we do we will try to pleat it right you will pleat it in such a way that the border is visible take small pleats possible it will look even more beautiful right and what do we do we will just tuck this entire thing here yes you can still pull the entire cloth from the knot below right so if you arrange this one arrange this yeah you can leave it kaira you can leave the feet yeah you can relax your feet you can relax the feet you can arrange this entire thing neatly okay i'm just taking this out let me do the pleating correctly cuz i got used to making him wear the dhoti so i'm doing it a little faster yes so you get this border again right so make sure that you tuck it in such a way that the border is visible try <laughs> now Side of this, Anna. Yes, 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 yes. Wait, Anna. Wait, wait, wait. Can you see how beautiful it looks? Can you, can you, can you turn around slowly, slowly, turn slowly, slowly, slowly. See, nowhere, nothing will be visible. Nowhere, anything will be visible. You all you can do is I haven't used one single pin. I've been telling this, right? If you can adjust these, then even behind you will have this border. Sky, do please. You will have this borders clearly visible. See. Turn slowly, na na. Turn slowly, slowly. Yeah. Keep one turn. Yeah. Turn. Not one single pin. Can you stretch your legs? Yeah. Jump, run, jump. Siva. <laughs> Are you comfortable? If I am, I am. Are you ready, man? Are you ready, man? Yeah. 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 <laughs> so Cairo is so comfortable. Yeah. Uh, now the only problem the children will Here have come is Cairo. The only problem the children will have is to go to the washroom. So. if you can help them out there will be an opening <laughs> there will be an opening here right so there will definitely be an opening through which the boys can go to the washroom so they need need not you know, need not untie the entire dhoti right and just fix it mutu sir yeah even not even the knot will not be visible right so tomorrow he would be wearing this i will give the finishing touches tomorrow right so as of now i will just show you only a little bit more just adding adding to what he's been wearing kind of all right so let's put a garland to the krishna and a <laughs> and a crown you can just use one or two pins if you want and i haven't used any pin it is safe for this is actually what i have got all of these i bought it last year right this one i got it from these um, the artificial flower where you get there i got this garland i love the color combination so i got it and i've just tied uh, tied a uh, satin tape right in such a way kind of such a way you adjust the length of it and it will not harm your child right so adjust the length of it and you can put a small knot behind i'm just doing it a simple small knot simple small knot behind just Now adjusting the length, so then this adjust. The length is adjusted. Okay, and then these I think you I think the you all will know these are called kadu pressable ones. Last year I got it. It's still there with me. So I'll just make him wear. The positive point is you can you can open it up and adjust it to your child's one. Yeah. You can make it. You make him wear. Make the child wear here, or you, you can push it up and make him wear as the bujha bow. <laughs> okay. Wait, 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 wait. Wait. Huh? Yeah. Press it. 
last year what i did is i used a rakhi you know this raksha bandhan right which just recently passed away right you get this round ones raksha bandhan i'll show it to you tomorrow mm, i made him wear it here so that also looks really classy right it not hurt you okay today now as of now i'm just making him wear here and just showing you roughly the krishna If you don't have this, then just buy Rakhi to them. Raksha Bandhan, that Raksha Bandhan, just buy. It will be still available in majority of the things. This one again, I got it last year. Yeah. So here it is. <laughs> Roughly with no makeup or with no, with uh, nothing extra added. You can just stay like this. Not like that. Yeah. Close all of these. Open this up. Hold it here. Close this. Open this up. Yes.
we can put a feet together and dance for you. Yeah. Yes, so these are the three ones. The first one is my favorite though. So, okay. Set. So this is our, <laughs> this is our more to you. And uh, yeah. so that is it for today. And if you do like this video, please do like, share and subscribe to my group. Right? Your comments, your likes, your subscriptions will keep us motivated. Yes. So I hope these uh, ones will help you. Oh yeah, I forgot to show you how to drape it for the uh, Radha. Right? So why do you have to always make Radha <laughs> wear uh, a skirt only? We can do something uh, like this also, a dhoti and then a one. Otherwise, with the same one, take a, take a dupatta. Because I have a one year old child. So for children, for parents who are having one year children or say two year children, uh, and want the child to be dressed as Deepa, you, you are, I mean, uh, sorry, uh, Radha, then um, you just take a dupatta like this in such a way that both the sides of the dupatta will, should look the same. So this is the, the opposite side, this is the original side. But then when you look at like this, they both look the same, right? So the, the ulta side or the, uh, the non-woven side or the oven side and the non-woven side, both of them should look the same, right? So you take the dupatta and you fold it like how you drape it for Varma Lakshmi, right? I think Varma Lakshmi or um, uh, goddess when you when you worship some goddess in the house, then you try to drape a sari to the god goddess, right? So the similar way, similar way, I'm following it, right? So what I've done, I've just made a pattern like this. That means the one below one part will be a little longer. I fold the into a little lesser lesser length right the entire cloth will be there and if you have a sewing machine at home it is even more good all that you have to do is after this just put a stitch here leaving around two finger space leave around two finger space try to put a stitch if you have a sewing machine just try to put a stitch from here till the end the two finger space just push a, a thread a, a nada which we call right or the thread through, through which we fasten our, our uh, pans or our um, uh, salva pans yeah so that one we just try to push it out and then try to tie it around the child it's easy i'll show this tomorrow when i do it for my daughter okay so that's all for today I'll show this tomorrow when I do it for my daughter. Yeah. That's all for today. Bye-bye.